What is going on everybody? Welcome back to Phones and Drones. To all you new viewers, thanks for checking out the channel. Make sure you subscribe, give us a thumbs up, leave a comment down below. I wanted to go ahead and do a quick tutorial video on how to pair any Android Wear smartwatch, whether it's Android Wear 1 or Android Wear 2, to an iPhone or an Android phone. The process remains the same. It is pretty easy. All you're going to want to do is from the Play Store, download an app called Android Wear and open it up. As you can see currently, I have my Movado Connect connected to Android Wear. It doesn't matter. All we're going to do is click on this little drop down menu here and click add a new watch. We're going to tap on the watch to begin, find our language, English US, and you should see ZW10, ZW10 pop up. We're going to click on it and it should automatically connect from there. You should have to verify it in a second when a prop comes up. As you can see it says Galaxy Note 8 would like to connect. I'm going to go ahead and say OK and it's connected. Now it's going to check for updates which sometimes does take a minute or two. I'm going to go ahead and go through the process with you until we're on the actual watch face to see. As you can see right now though I am using my Galaxy Note 8 along with my new ZTE Quartz that I actually just did an unboxing video for. For all y'all that did not see that, I'll throw up a link in the description for that as well. If you're looking for your first Android Wear watch, that watch right now is on sale at T-Mobile for $96. And that comes with cellular connectivity and all that. Pretty awesome for a starter watch and even a regular everyday watch. So here we go. As you can see, it says continue setup on the phone. And this came up. Copy your Google accounts to your watch. We're going to go ahead and do that. Tap on it. Click Next. and the process should continue on from there. I believe there's one or two more verification steps. We're going to go ahead and confirm the lock screen, password, and I want to copy my account. Yes, copy, and now it is copying everything on the watch. And it says you're all set. You can click or unclick this checkbox um, that says uh, improve your experience. I always uncheck it. Click done. There you go. You see my ZTE watch is connected. You should see the watch face. And that's it, guys. Um, this video is barely two and a half minutes long. And you can see we went through from start to finish with the setup. I hope this helps. Uh, the process is exactly the same on an iPhone. Just go to the App Store and download Android Wear instead of the uh, Google Play Store. If you all have any questions, leave a comment down below. Make sure you subscribe to the channel, like I said, and give this video a big thumbs up. It helps us out. Thanks, guys.